everyone welcome back to my channel today I made some beef Tex-Mex enchiladas they were very 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 good let me go ahead and teach you how to make them here I'm using a pound of ground beef I believe it's the 85% lean with 15% fat so it did have a good amount of excess fat um, that you will see me drain out in a little bit After draining out the fat from the ground beef, go ahead and add it back in. Go ahead and add some onion. We're going to saute the onion with the ground beef. I added a tablespoon of chicken bouillon and I also added some black pepper. Go ahead and mix all your spices together. I also added some minced garlic. We are going easy on the spices for the beef uh, because the majority of the taste will be in the sauce. Now let's start making the sauce for our enchiladas. Add some olive oil and I added some onions. The onions are optional but I do highly recommend that you add them in. To this we're going to add 1 4th cups of flour. Go ahead and whisk your flour in with your onion. You want to do this for maybe about 2-3 to three minutes, don't do the whisking more than that. Okay, so here comes the fun part. We're gonna go ahead and start adding all the spices. You're gonna be using two tablespoons of chili powder, two tablespoons of enchilada powder, one teaspoon of ground cumin, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of onion powder, one tablespoon of chicken bouillon. Or you can also use beef bouillon. Add in two cups of water. Make sure that your heat is on low at this point. Uh, whisk everything together for about three to four minutes. You're gonna start seeing your sauce thicken up and that is something that we want. Your sauce should have a thick consistency like this. Once it does, go ahead and set it aside. Add in some vegetable oil to a frying pan. We're gonna start lightly frying our tortillas. When adding in your tortilla, you need to make sure that your oil is hot. The frying process usually takes like 5 to 10 seconds at the most. Once you are done frying all your tortillas, go ahead and grab your ground beef and add some mozzarella cheese. Add as much as you like. Once you mix everything together, go ahead and add your beef mixture into the tortillas and uh, roll them up. Once you topped your enchiladas with cheese, go ahead and add in the sauce. These enchiladas are baked. It's best to cover with foil paper. Look how cheesy they look. They came out so delicious. I really, really recommend that you guys try these out. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.